The number of cases of coronavirus on the Diamond Princess cruise ship nearly doubled over the weekend, jumping to 135. Most of the 3,700 passengers and crew are still in quarantine, including a woman from Marysville. And hello again, I'm Steve Rabel. I'm Monique Minglovin, and Cairo 7's Didi Sun talked with her son today. Good news is, Didi, she is still healthy. Yes, thankfully she is still healthy. I'm told she is just trying to stay busy while quarantined in that small room of hers. So right now I'm at Pier 66 and this area is where many ships coming into Seattle dock. And the predicament with uh, Princess, with the Diamond Princess and several other cruise ships as well, it has King County thinking about that issue and also what happens, what measures will need to be taken if this problem lasts into spring. This is Susan Annabelle in Diamond Princess issued protective gear. They were all given uh, face masks, uh, uh, gloves. Enjoying the daily hour of outdoor time, the cruise ship allows quarantine passengers. It's her hour of freedom. Japan authorities are out there kind of monitoring them as they're out in their, you know, hour of fresh air. Her son Jeff is closely monitoring the situation from home. It's kind of surreal. There are more than 3,700 people on the ship. And late last night, Princess Cruises said the Japanese Ministry of Health confirmed another 66 coronavirus cases on board, bringing the total to 135 people sick. These images show Japanese healthcare workers in full hazmat suits. Almost 100% spike, you know, like that's pretty crazy. How could you not worry? Um, you know, you want your mom back in good health. The cruise ship's executive vice president addressed the problem in a YouTube video. It's unbelievably stressful and challenging for both our guests and our crew. What the company is going through had the King County Council today asking public health about our cruise industry. I'm very happy that, you know, we don't have cruises coming in right now. We'll be working with the CDC to um, understand whether they're going to make any special um, recommendations to the industry about this outbreak. Um, should it be persisting? Um, you know, in the spring when we start to see our cruises. Meanwhile, this son is counting down the days until February 19th when the quarantine ends and his mom can come home. She's a strong lady, uh, so that gives us a lot of hope, and she's, she's in a good place and very happy right now, uh, you know, considering the circumstances. And well, Princess Cruises announced today that everyone on board will get a full refund. Now, the total number of cases for coronavirus worldwide, it has reached 42,000. And so far, 1,000 people have died. Live in Seattle tonight, DD Sun, Cairo 7 News.